So this is a significant public health problem. But you're all here because, you know, here's the question. Why should you care about Legionnaire's disease? Well, obviously, it's a serious health risk associated with building water systems. And equally importantly, even a single case can dramatically affect the bottom line of an organization. Well, I want to give you one example. And this is Grady Hospital in Atlanta. And they had not done uh, proactive culturing, um, which is typical of hospitals across the United States. And they experienced an outbreak. In the first week of that outbreak, they spent over $700,000. So you know that if that's just the first week, they easily went over a million dollars dealing with that. Well, the cost is not only in dollars, but in lives. And this is an outbreak that was associated with cooling tower at a nursing home in, in Canada, and there were 16 deaths associated with that outbreak. Not only is there cost in terms of dollars and lives, but also cost to the reputation of your organization. Legionnaire's disease is a public relations nightmare. This is a report uh, from a, a hospital where the headline is hospital shower kills cured patient. The patient was in for cancer treatment, got Legionnaire's disease from exposure to the water in the hospital, and unfortunately passed away. And so what I say is Legionella makes the headlines and the stigma sticks. Legionella didn't kill the patient. The hospital did. So you have to keep that in mind as well.